In this video, we're going to take a look how a student or a user would be able to take or access an assessment through I.O. The first thing we're going to do is come to our Classic account. Once we are signed into Classlink, we're going to look for the icon that says I.O. We're going to click on this. Once you are here at I.O., it will prompt the user to sign in. We are not going to use this portion to be able to sign into I.O. Rather, we're going to come down to here where we see Google. Click on the icon that says Google, and you are looking for your hlpnet.net district Google account. If you do not see it here, you're going to want to select use another account. At this point, you're going to use the same login credentials that you use to sign into ClassLink. After you use your username, be sure to enter at hlpnet.net, and then next, and enter your password. Now, if you're not sure what your login credentials are, you have another option. I'm going to go back to the icon of ClassLink or to the page of ClassLink. From here, we're going to click on this icon that says Google Classroom. By clicking on this, this will automatically sign me into my district Google account. Now that I'm signed into my district Google account, I can come back to the I.O. app. I'm going to click on I.O. once more, come down to where it says Google, and now it automatically signs me in to my district Google account. If that didn't happen, be sure to locate the at hlpnet.net district Google account to sign in. From here on the left hand side, you should see where it says take test online. We're going to click on that. Now, if your teacher provided you a session ID, be sure to enter that here. Once you've entered the session ID, go ahead and click start. If you do not have a test, test session ID, you would click on this button here. My teacher did provide me one. I'm going to go ahead and take that session ID and I'm going to enter it here by pasting it. I'm going to click start and the next page should look like this where it says begin test. And when you click on that, you should begin the assessment. Thanks so much and best of luck with your testing.